Hey everyone, BNSF9382 here with a little video. Uh, over the weekend I went down to what I call my local hobby shop. Uh, it's about 35 minutes away. And, uh, you know, it's, it's exactly that. It's a hobby shop. It's not a train shop. So uh, <clears throat> they kind of cater to uh, a little bit of everything. But I, I try to pop in there every couple months and see what they have. Uh, you, you never really know. Uh, I did notice that they have a, uh, s a small selection of the new Bachman uh, locomotives. Uh, I, I wasn't really interested in purchasing one of those, but I did notice they do have them in stock. But uh, anyway, I picked up a couple things that I needed, some supplies, and I picked up a couple of pieces of rolling stock. So uh, let me uh, move this camera around and show you the new pieces of rolling stock I got. And uh, we'll go from there. So hold on while I move this around. Okay, the first piece of rolling stock that I got is this uh, Atlas 50 foot Berwick boxcar BNSF. Uh, like, uh, you know, most of these uh, uh, simple box cars, you know, on this one, the, uh, the doors do not open. Uh, obviously, it's got the uh, reflector marks on here, whatever they're called. And, uh, you know, as soon as I took this out of the box, I, I did replace the uh, couplers with some KD couplers. But uh, pretty nice little model it, it uh, rolls real nice and uh, no problems other than changing out the couplers but uh, you know again as soon as I took these out of the box I did apply a, a light weathering to this so it doesn't look brand new uh, still has a ways to go on that I'll probably end up adding some graffiti uh, decals uh, at some point but uh, that's it for now again just a light uh, weathering anyway the second uh, piece of rolling stock I picked up is this uh, train man 52 foot gondola uh, Herzog 3910. Again, uh, nothing special about this. Uh, I did take off the plastic couplers and replace them with uh, some KDs. And again, uh, very light, simple wash uh, for a weathering to start it off. You know, uh, the other day uh, when I was out running some errands, I uh, saw a Herzog maintenance truck out on the road. And uh, I have seen a few of these guys running around. They do a lot of the uh, signal maintenance and track maintenance in the area. But uh, this was the first uh, Herzog car I've seen at least locally in, in the hobby shop. So figured I'd just pick it up. At least it's something I know that's that uh, could be local. I think Herzog's pretty much everywhere, but uh, again, they do a lot of the work, maintenance work on signals and uh, crossings and all that around here. So anyway, uh, nice little car. Again, just a uh, quick light weathering, just so it doesn't look brand new. But uh, again, that's it for the rolling stock. I, uh, the main mission over the weekend was to get this ballast on this uh, industrial area to get the ballast done, which I did get completed. Obviously, that uh, ground foam back there in the back is just a base layer. 
but uh, I bought a small bag of brown ballast and as you can see the new bag that I bought is lighter in color than the older stuff that I had but uh, doesn't doesn't really bother me I I could care less whether it matches exactly I, I think it looks okay but uh, as you can see as I get farther down uh, this way it, it lightens up but uh, Anyway, I got all the ballasting done and everything, uh, no interference, everything works. So, uh, anyway, uh, this camera is, is about as good as it's going to get as far as moving around looking at this. I think this camera does pretty good if you can uh, hold it still enough. again uh, got the ballast on this service track all the way down there's uh, what's left over of the ballast that I used uh, Woodland Scenics and again all the way down to the uh, northern dead end of this track the, 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 this section down here is a little rough uh, obviously because it doesn't get the use but uh, I'm gonna probably roughen that up a little bit more uh, as we get into the scenery and put some overgrowth and, and details in, in this areas where it's less uh, less traffic but uh, anyway my plan is <clears throat> is to do these other lines in a different color or a different shade of ballast so uh, we'll see how that goes. I had the brown left over from before, so I figured I'd use that. But uh, don't know uh, about the other colors that I'm going to use as of yet. But. All right. Well, anyway, got some ballast done and some uh, two new pieces of rolling stock. So anyway, a uh, nice short video and... I guess we'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching.